everyone so it is Sunday and we just got home from church and everyone actually changed and we are about to go to Arden Mall because I want to look at JCPenney's and Macy's in their like the home goods department or where the house they sell the household stuff just see what I can get for my room or whatever so I think I may paint another coat on my white cabinets and I will show you guys. I think they look good but I still see it's still a few little streaks so I think I'm just gonna go over that with another coat of white. They were looking really good you guys. So we're in Macy's and <laughs> oh, 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 you press the... she touching the alarm. Don't do Stop, that Savannah. Don't do, don't do that. I can't undo it. You go to one person and no, we're going to the see? Would you press that one do too? too much? Everyone does too alone. much. Stop! Oh my gosh, I hate this feeling. Ah! I'm gonna go in the elevator and come on. <laughs> see, now I stopped on one, we ain't stopping that. Yeah. Now Wait. we should have stand here with Now we're gonna stand here, probably stare. Look who's over there with the kids. No, unfortunately, it's not. Yeah, she's the biggest kid there. Okay, Savannah. She is five. Always gotta come to the Disney store. Ooh, what is this? Is this Minnie Mouse, but yellow? It is, look at this. Oh, this is cute. I have had a long day. It is nine o'clock and we ran a bunch of errands and I just got back from Ikea. I'm loving my walls, look you guys. But I gotta finish painting my walls, what's not done. And I got some curtains to put up temporarily. They're not the curtains that I really want for here. And the blinds that I have in here is horrible. I'm gonna get new blinds, but I'm putting my curtain raw back up, but I just can't stand seeing the brown curtain against there. So I had to run out to Ikea to get some curtains. So I'm gonna do all that. And yeah, I just need to finish. This room is a mess. At least I'm, I don't know. It's a mess, so let me get it start, started painting so I can at least try to clean up some of this tonight. Okay everyone, I am sweaty, I know. It is almost 2 a.m. I am so tired, I'm about to go to bed actually. And as you can see, I have completed all the walls in the room. Everything is painted and I put up the curtains that I bought from Ikea and I probably should have ironed them or at least you know me I don't iron throw them in the dryer before I put them up because they are very wrinkled but I didn't and as you can see they're too long so I don't even know if I'm going to keep these you guys so that's why I'm not going to um, cut them and sew them to me they're not white enough I wanted something really really white and maybe I shouldn't because you know hands touching it whatever but my kids aren't little ones anymore so that should be okay but the ones that I wanted to get from overstock.com they were like pure white and it has some kind of design at the top so I still think I'm going to get those and with Ikea you have up to a year to return stuff so I just kept the bags and I probably will do that and on the inside I have this right here so I'll probably keep this this is not too bad but I actually wanted lace see my metal blinds that's gonna get changed um, I'm getting faux blinds okay and I got this stand from Ikea. Um, Cheyenne put it together for me tonight while I was painting. And yeah, I have my DVD player there and my cable box and my I Love Lucy um, DVD, the, well, the whole series. That just stays in my room. And I may get an, a plant, uh, not real one of course, because I kill everything. See my exercise videos and just videos. But anyway, I may get a plant to be there to sit there and that lamp is actually going to get changed once I find something that I really like so now I'm just trying to straighten up I can't put stuff on the wall over there where I paint it because um, I'm just gonna let it dry I don't want anything to touch it so I'm just trying to clean everything up over that's on this side and I really like this stand you guys I had a tiny little table that I had my TV on and I've had it for years and it was finally time for an upgrade so and that's actually it right there and all those are the curtains that I took off um, on my window I'm just gonna give it to Goodwill and yeah I'm just gonna finish straighten up and straighten up and go to bed because I am exhausted oh and one more thing one thing that I did learn 
by looking on Pinterest and looking at different styles of how to hang curtains and stuff like that. Okay, so you see how high my curtain rod is? It was not that high. It actually was just right above the blinds right there. Um, I don't know if you can see the little holes right there, but it was right there. When I was looking on Pinterest, it actually said if you raise the curtains up higher, it makes the room feel bigger, and it actually really does. So I'm happy about that part, but not really the curtains, you guys, because it's just it's just plain. I wanted something more fancy. Good morning, everyone. It is Monday. I am off work today. It's President's Day or something like that. So I've already been out and about and back home and it's 1130. How come when you have to get up for work or school or whatever like that, you're so tired and you can't get up, but on your days off, I was up at eight o'clock this morning, just like, ooh, what can I do today, whatever. So yeah, I think it's because when you're off, you can get up and do whatever you want, but when you have to get up and go to work, it's, you know, who really wants to work? So anyway, um, I just got a few things from Burlington Coat Factory, and it's funny because remember the blinds I showed you guys? Well, not the blinds, but the curtains that I got from Ikea. I'm gonna take those back because I found cheaper ones and nicer ones at Burlington. So I'm gonna exchange those and put those up, and I also got some white and gray hampers, laundry hampers, so I could take my brown ones out. And I'm just gonna straighten up my room a little bit and I actually spray painted the fans that I had in my bathroom in the corners that I had my perfume on on one side and then all my um, vitamins and stuff on the other. So I spray painted those white. Those are actually in the garage drying. I spray painted the hinges on my cabinets white so it can match. And yeah, start to be another productive day, you guys. Okay, everyone. This is kind of bad lighting. It's really dim in here because it's just gloomy outside. But these are the curtains I swapped it out for. I am loving these a whole lot better. And even though these aren't the fancy ones that I was gonna get at Overstock, I think I'm just gonna keep these because I actually wanted something lace right here. And then the panels that are here, I can always like tie them up on the side or something like that. But let me stand back full view. And I kept it up there, even though these don't go all the way down to the ground, I actually don't mind it that way. With my other curtains, I was always tripping over it, and I don't know, I just like it, I like it higher up. So, the ones that I got from Ikea, I'm just gonna take them back, not today. But, let me show you guys, compared to it, okay, white, right? See, you can tell the difference. These are kinda like off-white, even though the package said white. But these here are like completely white, which is what I wanted. I wanted stark white. And yeah, I'm starting to love my room so much, you guys. And like I said, these blinds are going to get swapped out. I can't wait till I do that. But also, I was thinking, okay, you guys, so I have vaulted ceilings. And ignore the paint on the ceilings. That's actually, we're going to fix that. Um, see that spot right there? Tyreek was up there with the ladder and he had paint on his hands and so he was like mom it's just a part of your room polka dot silly kid anyway so my question is to you guys if you would know or if you have any idea so see how my ceilings vaulted right and my headboard is not flat it's like curved ignore all my mess I still have a lot to clean up so this is what I was thinking on this side and this side some kind of I want a mirror that has like white around it, but I don't know why I want so many mirrors in this room. There's, I don't really need it, but I just something that I seen on Pinterest and I thought it was cute. And it was something similar to mine, like a um, oval shaped headboard. But anyway, a mirror there in the outline, white of course, and there, and above there, either a rectangular painting or one of the paintings that, you know, come in threes, but it forms a picture. Cheyenne said, it looks like I'm going to be trying to do too much if I do that because of my vaulted ceilings. But what do you guys think? Let me know. I'm still in the process of cleaning you guys, but I changed up my laundry hampers. I got that and it says laundry and I got that one a little bit bigger. And then that one right there. Um, I got it smaller because after I fold those clothes and put them away, hopefully by me having a smaller basket to put my clean clothes in, it'll make me Put them away sooner. Probably not. Wishful thinking though. 
So I'm really tired, you guys. It's 12.30 and like I said, I've already been out and about and just doing a bunch of stuff. So I actually think I'm, no, I can't rest yet. I have to paint another coat on the cabinets and then I'm going to relax for a little bit. Busy, busy, but at least I'm getting things done. So yeah, I'm really excited how things are turning out, you guys. And yeah, I wish Savannah would make up her mind on what she wants for her room. First she wanted, you know, pink, and then, then she didn't know. Then she wanted red and pink, and I'm like, that's gonna be Valentine's Day 24 <laughs> seven in your room. She honestly doesn't know, and this kid, she's so, she cannot make a decision. She'll make it and then she'll regret it. So I told her, I'm like, once you make your decision for your room color, when I buy that paint, that's it, you're done. So she's gonna just have to deal with it. <laughs> but if she can never get that far. Let me show you what I have done so far. I've actually, since I got back, I slept all afternoon, which I needed it, it felt good, but I still have been productive, so it's not like I haven't done anything today. And you guys are probably gonna get sick of seeing my room updates, but this is what I'm doing now, so you get to see it. Okay, so I got this today. This is sort of like the one in my bathroom. Um, I got it from TJ Maxx, and I can't for the life of me remember what type of flowers this is. Of course, it's fake, because I can't keep anything alive. <laughs> and then I got these um, flameless candles. Is that what you call them? Yeah, where you put the battery in. And I got this today at Home Goods. No, I take that back. I got this at Home Goods, not TJ Maxx. I got this at Home Goods. And let me show you guys actually what I did. So this was on the clearance rack, and it was, I think, $5. But look, it's really silver or whatever. Oh, $3. Yeah, three dollars. So it was really silver, but I spray painted it white. I've been spray painting everything, you guys. So that's what I'm gonna keep that on. And I may try to do something else to make this more decorative around it. I don't know, but I kind of like that. So that's what I did. And I actually really like this setup. My little table here, better than the other one that I had. Okay, and you remember my stand right there that was brown it is now white because i spray painted it and this one over here is white too so yeah it looks a whole lot better than the brown i just need to finish up my cabinets you guys and slowly put all this crap away i can't wait till i'm totally done because my room is a mess the house is a mess actually because we have stuff just thrown out there try to make a trip to goodwill this week to get some stuff out of the house because it's just, it's looking like a train wreck. And it's not dirty or anything, it's just cluttered because all the stuff we're purging. So yeah, you guys, that's what I've done so far. And yeah, I think it's only like about 6.30 and it's still early, so I still get to relax and enjoy my evening. I do think I'm going to paint some more of the, well, the cabinets are done being painted. I just need to put the final coat. I'm not using the decorative glaze, which I used in my cabinets, and that's what makes it darker. I don't want that in here, so I'm not gonna use that. I'm just gonna go straight to the protective top coat, and that takes 12 hours to dry, so by the time I get home from work tomorrow, or when I come home from the gym, um, then I can drill the holes in for the hardware, and put them up. I'm so excited, you guys. Everything is coming together. It's starting to look so nice, and 